close this through with the reading for the collective. Take what resonates throughout the rest. You might be having um, clarity in this situation. Ten of Wands reverse just fell out. Um, details about people around you, motivations, small things that could be causing stress. Um, you might be having some type of clarity around those things. Um, but let's see what the collective needs to know. I appreciate all of your positive energy. Seven of Swords reverse. Lies, cheating, stealing, getting exposed. So this could actually even include people around you where maybe you felt stress, but you weren't clear. There could be some clarity yourself, uh, around yourself. Um, that's not even sort of the main kind of villainous energy that's been trying to steal something from you. Um, this could be like minor players almost. But anyway, Seven of Swords Reverse, somebody is has been um, trying to be sneaky, stealth. They could have been trying to steal something. Um, and they're exposed. So no swords reverse. That's the main issue here. That's the subject. Someone being exposed. The problem is judgment. So this person is under judgment. It means the universe has spoken. Archangel Gabriel is blowing their horns. Um, someone has to take accountability. And also, it's very clear what the universe's position is on your energy. Uh, or it's. I feel like it's becoming more clear for whoever this is. They're under judgment. Someone might be having to take accountability for this lie or something they stole. The Emperor reverse in the subconscious. So if this is about a masculine energy, they could feel like they, this is not the, the this wasn't the correct way to lead or they're going to lose a leadership position either because they were overly controlling um, or, um, this could be somebody that has been collaborating with a masculine energy in the reverse and uh, they know that whatever this information is, is going to take this person down with them or that they've been collaborating with someone who isn't truly a leader or someone could be feeling like they're going to lose their authority. Um, someone also deep down could be feeling like they were raised wrong, like it's their father's fault. Magician Reverse, popping out here, Three of Swords, so somebody broke their own heart by manipulating a situation or by allowing themselves to be manipulated by someone who was doing something very dark. This could also be someone who feels heartbroken because they're unable to manifest either they're getting their confidence from the wrong place. They don't have any confidence. They feel like they don't have the skills to do something um, or something wasn't very intelligent or they don't have the ideas, the willpower. Um, that could be why they turn to something dark here as well. This could be someone that dipple dabbles in lower vibrational spiritual practices and all they did was break their own heart. They're under judgment for what they did and they're experiencing the, the karma or the ramifications for the actions they took. The recent past. For this energy, I mean for the collective, what does the collective need to know? Recent past, what's the primary energy? The world came out kind of sideways. So the cycles finish, someone might be feeling like, well that was the best of it. Um, Someone might not want to let go of something. This could have to do with someone not wanting to go on a trip or some sort of reluctance tra having to do with travel. Um, as a cycle is ending and a new one is starting, um, this could also feel like, you know, the end of the year, someone reflecting back at the, the whole year, um, what they've done with their life. 
expectations and tensions, Queen of Wands reverse. So if this is uh, Emperor, then they feel like an Emperor in reverse, then they feel like they're dealing with a feminine energy, like the best that they, they have, if this is a couple, is someone who's real jealous and insecure and aggressive and witchy. Um, that's who they... Maybe it's this Queen of Wands that got exposed for lying, cheating, stealing. Maybe it's something's been become very clear about somebody here. Queen of Wands reverse, somebody's witchy, uh, manipulative, angry, pushy, jealous. Um, if it's this Queen of Wands reading, if it's there, the primary focus, then um, this could be intentions that are on par with someone who has these attributes. So, you know, acting out of jealousy and insecurity, mean, cruel, pushy, uh, witchy intentions in a bad way. Someone could be playing games with someone, so might be realizing that someone was playing games. Or there could be someone here that's very busy. Um, or, I mean, you're very busy. There's something about you being very busy that is significant to this energy, these people. In your future, Six of Pentacles reverse, Five of Pentacles, someone who clearly abused their power is out in the cold and might need need help from somebody. They, they could be experiencing a very severe financial hardship in the near future. I mean, if this is a thief, they might have to give something back or something's backfiring here or they're losing resources because they've been exposed. Um, Nine of Cups, this could make you very happy or they're thinking that you're going to be very happy and they think of your happiness or um, confidence as like smug. Um, so that could be what's in the back of their mind while they're, you know, they tried to shoot you down, put you in your place, it seems like. They didn't want you to be happy. And whoever this is, is out in the cold here, experiencing some sort of hardship. And while they're experiencing this hardship and needing help, it seems like one of the things that they can't stop thinking about is how this is going to make you happy. Um... So that you walked away from something and now their hardship is going to make you happy. That's what they're thinking. That's not what you are thinking, uh, but that's what they think about the situation. If this is a masculine energy that this emperor reversed that discarded you for a situation that was built on lies here, they could be under judgment. Um, it could be playing out karmically. Um, with their finances, this person could have chosen a Queen of Wands reverse um, over you and then gone against you with some sort of lie, cheats, cheating, stealing. This person could have felt like they needed to do this because when they discarded you or turned their back on you, they felt like you, um, they automatically made you into their enemy and they needed to destroy you before you called them out. Not for everyone, but that could be, um, because, um, yeah, that could be motiv motivation why this person would, you know, they discarded you and did something pretty, I would say, cruel, and you, you were the, the main one that really knew the truth here. And I felt like they feel like they felt threatened. And that's not for everyone, but for someone here, that's what this motivation was of this Emperor Reverse. They, they, they did something for a leadership position. This is somebody who, you know, tried to knock you down and um, I feel like this person stood on your shoulders or tried to steal something from you. That is if this is an ex. There's definitely a couple here, though. Emperor Reverse, Queen of Wands Reverse. Um, they could have ha tried to have you be rejected as well. Um, the lens these people are looking through, the sun. There's something about your happiness that's a big deal here for these people. 
So it wasn't just about trying to squelch you and stop you and block you and destroy you before you call them out. It's also about um, something about your happiness, because like, like I got picked up here in the near future, there's something about somebody feeling like um, even they're, they're going through this tough circumstance, but it's almost like what matters more to them is the fact that you're going to be happy. And it's like, that's what's getting to them. They see you being happy now. This hasn't even happened in the near future. There's something like, also, this is, um, they're getting exposed for something or something as clear as day about this lie. Um, yeah, and there, this could have to do with some child, or this could also do with love, loving energy, your loving energy, or somebody's sweet feelings. Somebody could be realizing something about you. Somebody could be reading something or researching something or telling someone something, uh, researching, looking at something that makes something very clear. Um, and it's making someone feel defeated, like they... They lost, they lost control. Um, yeah, someone feels like they lost control, like they spun out. Um, in the environment, we have five of swords, so... Somebody that tried to bully you could be dealing with a bully or feel bullied by a group of people. Or what I really feel like this is, is because it's in the environment, five of swords, this is someone who wants to win at all costs, it's very hateful and driven by their ego and that because it's in the environment it's plain for anyone to see so i feel like whatever this lie is that came out that's exposed they're under judgment people can all see it now five of swords that they tried to bully you and do something very hateful in order to win and everybody knows it because it's in the environment and something's exposed here nine of swords reverse um Part of what's exposed could be that, for one, um, these people are in a nightmare. It could be very clear the nightmare was meant for you and that you got out of it. They're in a nightmare and it's of their own making because they tried to, to do something here driven by hate and this ego, ego wanting to win something um but it's coming out here this could have to do with work um it's also very clear that you're spiritually protected people can see that something didn't hit you someone did something pretty horrific here um hopes and fears of this energy Five of Cups, Regret, that could be a tough emotion for somebody, especially if they're uh, operating from like a, this is like a narcissist, looking within could be very difficult because it opens up the floodgates for what feels to them like endless darkness there's like no end to it they don't know truly who they are they don't know how to go within they reject their shadow they reject it because it's too hard for them to there's no way to heal it that's their perspective because they feel like there's nothing there this person might have some type of i'm not a doctor but some sort of like disassociative i don't know exactly what that means i'm just hearing the word it's more, more like, um, I don't know, not, I like, they've got some type of like fragmented personality or something. I'm, that's not for everyone, but there's something about, um, maybe it's just narcissism. Cause this person feels like shattered pieces and like this person put, put pieces back together again and created a false reality that was built by their ego. So something could have happened to this person. Yeah, three of swords. 
there's something that could have happened to this person at a certain point in time. And it's all relative because if you could have got, you could have been through something similar or worse. Um, and you could have put the pieces back together again. Um, in a more healthy way. This person might not have had the capacity to put the pieces back. So I, I know people have free will. Looking at the shadow, looking at the shadow can be tough. Looking at, you know, what's broken inside of us can be, can be tough. Um, but I feel like this person refused to do that. And I, and I just explaining from this re reading, the reason why it feels too, um, endless. It feels like there is no end to the darkness. It's like they will be enveloped by it. It's like they'll cease to exist. Yeah, and they're heartbroken anyway, so it didn't work. It's just like something about you, a queen of swords, or there's another feminine energy here. It might, it might be a professional that's involved, um, or this has to do with your perception or your clarity. Someone could have misjudged you, devalued you. Um, this queen of wands reverse, this emperor reverse, especially if they were driven by their ego, Everything's about how much better they are than you. They could have um, decided you weren't an intellect, intellect, or that you weren't as smart as they are. Um, they could have looked down on you, and so par partially this like sort of ego death or what's bothering them is your intelligence because they wanted to write you off. They wanted to write you off, so the fact that you have. It's also something you're saying, or it's the way you handled, okay? It's also the way you handled this situation. It's like, in their eyes, at least if you had, you know, popped off, or <laughs> you had um, not spoken your truth, or it's just that you were very graceful. So it makes it look worse, what they did. Yeah, you have the star energy. This is what they were. They were anti-star energy. This light, this inspiration. This person born to shine. This inspiring person. This light-filled person. This visionary. This unique person. This person that has a vision for the future for all, really. Because it's Aquarius. That's what Aquarius is, is about the whole. Um, it's a very individual sign that, that cares a lot about the whole. And this also feels like North Node. You being on your North Node. That's what they're upset about. Outcome. Oh, wow. Outcome the star. I love how that popped out, too. Wow, and we have King of Cups under the deck. So I feel like there's a King of Cups that... Is already thinking about the future and where this is going. This is a masculine energy in the upright. Someone that's emotionally de um, dependable. Who has mastered their emotions. They could have a lot going on underneath. So they could hide things from themselves even. But they have a good heart. And um, I almost feel like these are flowers even. I feel like this person wants to give you your flowers. They see what's happening here. I feel like this person has a really strong intuition, this masculine energy. And the reason why they're looking out towards the future is because they've already read all of this intuitively. Whereas like when, yeah, they know something's all about greed and power, power dynamics. That's what was driving someone. They read the people energetically, they read the situation, they've scanned, and this is, feels intuitively, they've scanned the situation out to the 
logical conclusion, but intuitively. And that's what's great about following intuition or, or being an intuitive person is because, you know, you can, you can look at something logically and follow a bit of your intuition, or you can maybe look at, you know, both your intuition and your logic, like this Queen of Swords energy, and be able to see a logical conclusion. And I feel like that's why this King of Cups is looking beyond what's happening now towards the star energy. So I feel like this person wants to give you something or meet you there. Um, or they know where this is going. This is someone that, you know, I don't know if this is, what type of alliance this is, but I feel like this is a good person. This is like a benevolent leader. Um, someone that you can count on. I feel like they're looking past all of this. They're not going to let the situation drain them. It's almost insignificant. It's just basically they know what's going to play out. I don't know if they... I feel like this, whoever this King of Cups is, has known about whatever this is for quite a while. So this could be someone who, that's the thing about being intuitive. So you already, sometimes you see how something's going to play out. So you live through it once when you intuit. And then you've got to stand back and watch, watch it play out. And then you've got to deal with while it's playing out the energies of people, almost it feels like ga being gaslit, like you didn't see what you just saw, but you know where it's going. So that's where, it's not that you're wishing something on someone, but you know where something's headed. And then when it plays out, that's like a third version of it, because now it's what you already saw. You know, and then I guess it becomes a memory, so then you've got four versions of the same event. Um, <laughs> something like that. Um, so I feel like you're in, this is version three. This is, you saw this playing out. I feel like this King of Cups has a similar, I'll say like strength. Um, and um, I wonder if we should clarify the details of any of this. Someone got exposed. Might have to do with a negotiation. Something someone stole from you. Enthusiasm. This is also like the sun. That's what someone's looking at. Maybe this has to do with your happiness. Or something's gonna make you happy. Someone was trying to dominate the way someone feels. Someone can't criticize you anymore. Someone's very intuitive. This manipulation won't work anymore. This could have to do with someone's inheritance. Seven of Swords, someone's real happy. Wow. Ostentation reverse fell out. So somebody could have been living high on the hog because of a lie or was just after money, they're gonna lose all of it. That's what's happening in the near future. They got exposed. A lot of people are talking about it or see it. This is news. There's news, this can involve gossip. Somebody was under some type of illusion. Somebody can't be manipulated here. They've lost their protection. Someone's not going to be able to do things impulsively just because they want to. Someone was trying to create some type of resistance against you by criticizing you. Someone who was two-faced. I feel like that's what's exposed. You endured. People know you endured something as well. They see you as very strong, like a strong spirit. And someone who dealt with the dark in a very light way with the sun and in Scorpio. You exposed something very dark by being steadfast, 
intuitive. Queen of Wands reverse. Someone has to deal with this person. Um, or this is what they've... I don't know. This is... Seven, uh, Queen of Wands reverse. Why is that in the drama reverse? I feel like they've got to deal with this person. They know you've got to deal with this person. If they don't want to have a drama, they're going to have to wear a mask around this person. Or this Queen of Wands Reverse is going to try to avoid a drama by wearing a mask. Because everybody's talking about it. They shouldn't have criticized you. Or said things that weren't true. Um, yeah, everything's falling apart here. Emperor Reverse in the subconscious. This has to do with convention and achievement. Somebody made a move to be a leader to achieve inside a group and stick to the rules or stick to expectations. That was somebody's pathway, but deep down, whatever it was on paper, the obvious route that involves some sort of lies or somebody falling for something here um, didn't work, and someone could feel like they're losing losing their position from from a they're not a leader, or they could feel like yeah, can achievement convention. Someone thought this was the right way to go. There's no romance here. They should have taken this risk. They can't keep being fake here, they were sold a dream or they were being overly idealistic about something that's not real. And they were led by desire. This wasn't a good gamble. Being fake. Um, near future. This is a huge loss. In the near future, financial loss. There's no romance here. They shouldn't have taken this risk. There's a huge financial loss. Um, they could have also. They're also losing love. Um, something's coming to light here. The sun or the sea being happy about something. Order reverse. There's no order here. Five of Swords. Somebody is coming across like a hateful bully, driven by their ego. That's what, that's, somebody was trying to hide it. It's exposed now because of whatever they did. Um, innovation reverse. They're not the ones with the innovation. They could have tried to steal something from you and say that it, you know, it was them. Or they tried to block your innovation. That's very clear. They tried to stop you from being self-actualizing. Everybody can see it. And they were discriminating against you somehow. There could have been bigotry here or trying to keep you out of something because they were ha hating on you. Wow, and jealous. They could have lied or even stole something from you, but then they couldn't complete it. Um, but people see your patience with something. It's the way you handle it that kind of makes it even worse for whoever did this. Um, yeah, there could be love involved or a couple that did this. Um, Five of Cups, someone just feels like they're going to have to live their life with regret, it looks like. Um, not taking a loss because you <coughs> endured something, because you didn't... Someone feels like they should have had more... Maybe stood up for themselves, or it's something to do with your patience. Someone read you wrong. Someone shouldn't have tried to manipulate you. Someone, they're worried about living with regret, trying to block a negotiation, being fed a dream, or trying to sell a dream. They didn't get fulfillment from this. It's something about independence, regret, regret for leaving you independent, regret for trying to block your independence, regret for not being independent. You're not easily distractible. Outcome is the star energy, and we have patience next to the King of Cups. If you resonate with this message, I hope that it helps, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye.